<laughs> so I'm in Lawrence guys, I'm at Bowersock. It just rained the last two, three days a lot. And it hasn't done that in a while. It's really good. Um, it's really moving here guys. Even though this is probably where a lot of the fish are going to be, I'm going to probably come down here. Um, probably right in here. That log right there looks like it could be a good pole holder. Um, but man, it is moving. Uh, catfish, they love that water moving. And uh, so I was able to catch some bait. I'm going to get down right here, right where it starts to kind of become slack. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of current still. I'm using live bait. Just bluegill and some sunfish. I'm gonna use them live unless they die or if I feel like I'm not getting any bites on live, I might cut one up. Uh, and this is actually the easiest route down here because you get to walk along that boardwalk right there. So, all right, I'm gonna get set up. How's it going? That guy that was fishing right next to me over here is leaving and asked, asked if I needed any bait. So this is a fresh, awesome awesome size uh shad so i'm gonna cut him up and put him on a couple poles and then put a live out there see how things are going dang man he he really came through man i was hoping for some shad so now i get a fish with a variety of baits which is fun to see what's biting on what and so i'm gonna get him in the water here's the head piece i'm gonna go ahead and send out and then i'm gonna put just a side like this on and get a live out there i went ahead and put the live the live bait over in this left side and both uh, the heads right in the middle and uh the shad sides on the far right but it's, it's really strong current through here and so i instantly uh my line instantly got like locked up and i'm hoping it's just the bait or, or i'm hoping it's just the, the the weight that got maybe stuck on something or whatever it is but uh, I'm gonna leave it for now. I'm not gonna, Lawrence is not a place that you reel in and check every time you think something happened. But if nothing's going on here in a little while, you reel it in, reel it in and check it. Oh, 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 oh my. Got one, got one. Please don't get stuck. Oh, he's good, good size. Oh, wow. Feels like a log. Dragging me down the river. Oh, wow. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I'm trying to get him in here. Don't pop off. Got him right in the 
Yeah, I get over there where my poles are at. This guy took it down. Ow, he's biting me. Woo! I get a weight. Don't you go anywhere, buddy. Woo! That was on the shad, just the gizzard shad side. He took it down on the uh, snagging rod, so. I'm glad I brought it. Huh. We'll go ahead and get him back in the water. Forty-eight, forty-nine. I'll say forty-nine because he's heavy. Oh. Woo! Oh my goodness. Oh. Go home, buddy. There it goes. So I stayed for a little bit longer and I was just getting a lot of gar bites. There's a lot of gar in the water down here. Um, and so I am uh, heading out. Till next time, Lawrence. Appreciate you guys watching. Have a good year, guys.